James Acosta with the U.S. Border Patrol is glad to work side by side with National Guard troops in an effort to secure New Mexico's border. Uh, so far, it, it's, been a, it's been a good showing for both agencies. Um, you've always got a learning curve. Uh, however, I think the National Guard has stepped up as they usually have and uh, picked up uh, what it is that we've asked them to do. According to Lieutenant Colonel Jamison Herrera with the New Mexico National Guard, what they're asked to do since September 1st is monitor cameras. We are looking out with cameras during the daytime and at nighttime and enabling us to see any illegal activity, uh, uh, undocumented immigrants, and we're able to call the Border Patrol and law enforcement agencies and allow them to do their job. Acosta says the National Guard will just be used as an extra set of eyes for the Border Patrol. They won't actually stop anyone suspected of coming across the border illegally. They're not authorized to uh, make contact, arrest um, any of the suspected aliens or smugglers. They simply call us uh, and we respond as quickly as we can. However, by monitoring high-powered cameras all day and infrared cameras at night, Acosta says it allows the Border Patrol to be more flexible. The National Guard are taking the positions that uh, traditionally agents would uh, man and allowing us to free up that agent to uh, move on to other areas and uh, allow us to adjust our manpower uh, a little more freely. Automiro Cordero with the Border Patrol believes with the additional manpower the Border Patrol has already added since 2006, they've achieved a lot of success. You have the city of El Paso, which is the second safest city in the nation, but yet across, uh, across a river, which is most of the year a dry riverbed, uh, you have probably the most dangerous uh, city in the world. Uh, yet we've been able to prevent that spillover of violence. And for Acosta, adding 82 National Guard troops in New Mexico to the 26,000 Border Patrol agents in the region will only add to the recent success he believes the Border Patrol is having. Bringing the National Guard out here just, just helps us lock it down even more and start uh, focusing on, on some other areas that we may not have been able to focus on in the past. For KRWG, I'm Jared Anderson.